Dimasa Kudeybergena. Welcome, Dina. Dimash. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Uh, so, I mean, first we we're gonna start with um, what brings you to Serbia. <laughs> uh, I enjoy it. I enjoy it. Uh, first time I've been in Serbia almost eight or nine years ago, <clears throat> when I was twenty or twenty-one years old, and in that time uh, I had a dream. Just I need to come back to Serbia one more time because I love Serbian. Uh, p- public, I I love uh, your country and uh, so many kind persons. So I enjoy it. Thank you, thank you very much. Um, tell me, we have to talk about your vocal range. I mean, that's the first thing that everybody <laughs> talks about when we bring up Dimash. So you have like uh, six octaves and two semitones of vocal range. Is that correct? You know, uh, actually, it's not most important thing. Uh, I don't. I just want to keep some secret about it, because uh, when audience listen to my voice, I wanna uh, show to them my feelings when I'm singing. It's most important thing. Uh, but some vocal skills, vocal range, some facts about vocal range is. I think it's not most important thing. Yeah, but it's pretty amazing to to have that <coughs> that. Uh, uh, possibility to do that stuff Thank that you, you do with much. your voice, yeah. Uh, so, uh, tell me something about your your f- first steps in the music. Like, when did you start? <coughs> uh, I did performance uh, when I was two years old, uh, but I don't remember how I did how I did it. Uh, but my parents told me about it, and uh, the second one. Uh, it was when I when I was uh, five years old, and uh, I remember that moment very clearly. Uh, and the conductor called me to stage like Marat Aitimov, and uh, Marat Aitimov he's my vocal coach, and uh, he was really very famous in our country in that time, mm-hmm. and still very famous, of course, and. Uh, then I did performance with song about my burn city, about Achtubi. Mm-hmm. I still remember that moment. Yes, and uh, when I was five years old, I did performance in one competition uh, called it Aina Lion, and uh, I say I said winner there, and uh, I earned <coughs> three dollars. <laughs> That's yes. amazing. <laughs> and uh, I was really very happy because it my uh, it, it's my how to say first money. Yeah. And uh, I'm very uh happy because uh I get a chance to share with my money with my family, you know. Yeah. It was an amazing time. Yes, I remember it. Great. And you also I heard <coughs> the story, I don't know if it's true, but that uh, you you draw something in the in the school that nobody is drawing like everybody's drawing like cars and houses and stuff and you draw yes uh i draw you know uh, almost a lot of things about music about some instruments about some studio about some microphone something like this and uh of course i uh, I was interested about car, about a uh, lot of uh, lot of things. Uh, who interested? Uh, how to say? About house, about cars, about anything. But sports, sports, of course, mm. yes. But uh, when I was kid, I was too much focused about music, and the still same, still same. Yeah, it shows. It shows yes. today. Yeah, definitely. Um, so I have one question that's probably another kind of a record. Uh, your first album, yes, ID, in yes. 2019, <coughs> was w- went platinum in like a couple of like 30 seconds or something. Yes. 37 seconds, yeah. Is that correct? Is that correct? Yes. And uh, I want to use this chance to uh, t- say a lot of thanks for all my audience. For all my fans who support me, who love me, 
No, because of them, uh, now I'm still working. Now I'm still singer. Now I'm still have some solo concerts around the world. Of course, it's because them support. Without audience, without fans, I have do nothing. Yeah, that's true. It's you you have fans here also. You saw it when you come to our wow, when you came great. to our, our studio. Thank you. Yeah couple of uh, couple of fans here definitely more than couple <laughs> I must say um, so how do you like it in Serbia so far I mean did you try some of our food maybe <coughs> I heard you like to eat like to to try different stuff uh, in, in when when it comes to food is that true like you can you can try pretty much everything every cuisine you know yeah. when I'm when I'm hungry <laughs> I'm re- <laughs> I can eat everything you know Yeah. No, <laughs> only I cannot eat pork. Uh, yeah, yeah, no yes, pork. of course. Well, in Serbia, there's a lot of pork. Yeah. <laughs> yes, and uh, our <coughs> our food's a little bit similar, I think, because yeah. Serbian Serbian uh, you you like to eat a lot of meats too, yeah. like Hazak. Yeah. Of course. So we are similar, and uh, our languages. <coughs> Hazaks know very well Russian language mm-hmm. and uh, when you talk in your language uh, I can understand what you're saying yeah yes yeah we have some similar words yes and uh, <coughs> Serbian have a lot of Turkish words yeah yeah yes. we do we do yeah for <laughs> example true. Dorba uh, Tambura Dombura Tambura da. yes yeah yeah, yeah tambura. you know how to play Dobra I mean Tambura Yeah, of course, of course. First time, <coughs> my grandfather teach me uh, when I was four or five years old. F- from that time, I'm still playing dombra. Yeah, people don't know that probably about you that um, you you're not just a vocalist. You are you're a musician. Like you you play instruments. You play piano. Yes, I'm gonna try to do my best, uh, but. <coughs> Not like the best musician, but not bad, I think. Well, I mean, even if you know one instrument to play, that's that's a big deal. And uh, I mean, we're not gonna talk that much about your singing anymore because everybody <laughs> already knows it. But I have to bring up something else. Uh, one more thing about your your singing. You sing in how many languages? That's also uh. amazing. <laughs> More than twelve or more than thirteen? I don't remember. Yes. I don't know if I can even say like thirteen languages. Like to just make a list of thirteen languages, and you know how to sing thirteen. <coughs> uh, you know, if I like that song, for me doesn't matter in which language. Uh, I can, I I can learn it. Yes, I'm trying. Th- Uh, trying to do my best for learn it because because of music because of music will you ever sing in Serbian uh, when I was <laughs> 15 years old I remember one Serbian song call it Ovoje Balkan ah, Ovo Balkan yeah yes somebody uh, did performance with this song in Eurovision oh yeah yeah Uh, it was Milan Stankovic. Yes, Milan Stankovic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah, it's a re- very up- upbeat song. Yes, yeah. very interesting song, you know. Yeah, so. it has a lot of like elements from both of our cultures, yes. like musically. Yes, and uh, I know a lot of musicians. Uh, I I know a lot of great Serbian musicians. Uh, I know a lot of. Uh, Serbian composers and the mm-hmm. actor just yesterday I met with one of the biggest in your country not yeah. only in your country in also Russia in too in Russia too uh, Milos, Milos Bikovic, Milos Bikovic. Yeah. yes he's an amazing actor I think yeah you were, you were performing last night uh, here on uh, Karic, uh, yes, 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 yes. How, how was how was the experience performing in Serbia again? Like missing, I mean, coming 
to Serbia and again and performing like like a big artist now. Because in t- 2001, you were you were in Serbia in 2001, yeah. You yes. Said, yeah. You were you were a kid <laughs> back then, but yes. now you're like a really big singer, a really big star worldwide. You know, uh, star. stars in my mind, I think uh, we're just uh, how to say we are all humans stars on the sky yes yeah yeah definitely i agree but i mean you can't deny the the popularity that that you have in the in the world and uh, i mean in serbia um we are we are like very musical people yeah of We're, course yeah, I know we it. like music very much but we don't have a chance to to hear someone like you i mean there's no one like you probably but Maybe Some you have better than me, brother. Mm, uh, you need to try well, to search more. <laughs> yeah, I can. I can say that because I don't think so. But <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, uh, when it comes to the quality of music, I'm um, speaking in that terms. Like we don't have much um, chance to hear someone like from outside of Serbia that sings that sings so well like you do. So people yesterday, last night, who was really they were they were really like amazed thank you very much thank I, you last I, night i enjoyed it really because so so many kind persons you know it was amazing amazing night yeah and can you tell me one more thing like who is your favorite artist artist yeah uh, i know i know the actor the favorite <coughs> actor of yours who? is jackie chan yes yeah. yes <laughs> yes it? is it yeah. that's true uh but artists like musician in general like a musician, like of a course. Role model, role of model course, or something. it's Luciano Pavarotti. Oh. Of course, it's uh, amazing singer Celine Dion. Yeah. Of course, it's uh, Andrea Bocelli. Of course, it's uh, Placido Domingo and uh, Michael Jackson and uh, Freddie Mercury. And a lot, a lot. You know. Uh, I don't have, <coughs> I don't have, just like uh, idol, idol like. I, I I don't know. Uh, I'm I never been fan, and I never been fan. I just respect them because they did big work. They did a uh, lot of incredible musics, you know. So because of this, I respect them, and uh, I understand <coughs> they did really very hard work. Yeah. Yes, and that they become famous because of them's hard work, and uh, of course, it's God's support. Yes. Okay. Um, so, thank you very much for thank you for your uh, time here, and uh, I mean it was a really an honor and pleasure talking to you and uh, hopefully we'll see you some other day in Serbia in the future yes we saw a concert brother yeah yes yeah yeah I hope I hope too okay thank you very much thank you very much brother